Today, I'm going to show you a flipping method that I've been using to make millions of diamonds every single day. But you must act quickly because after I publish this video, a lot of people are going to know the method and therefore it's just going to get worse, sadly. So if you're watching this video, don't tell your friends about it or else this method is just going to become useless in the next few days. As always, remember to put your Roblox username down below in the comment section as well as leave a positive comment and you have a chance at winning an exclusive pet. We do this on every video, so make sure to do that as well as like and subscribe. I found this method thanks to one of my Discord members by the name of Matt, so shout out to Matt. We're going to get right into this video because it is a juicy one. So I'm sure there are some people that know about this. It's not like a super secret dark method that you have to do. It's just a method of buying something for cheap and then using that to make something that costs more. Uh, so I don't know why there's a gap between the prices of these two things. All right. So as some of you might have guessed, this new method uses the magic machine. So basically what we're going to be doing is going around and buying magic shards from the trading plaza, which sell for about like 10.5 K. But honestly, sometimes you can find them for like 9,000 each. And then you take those and you combine them in the magic machine to create a huge potion. So let's say you find magic shards at 10 K each and you combine 16 of them, which is 160 K. When you combine it, you can then sell the huge potion for 194 K. So this method, this method works the best when you have a ton of diamonds already because you can go ahead and buy as much magic shards as you possibly can. But basically, you're just going to want to try to find them as cheap as possible. The break even cost for these magic shards would be like 12,000 each. So honestly, anything under that, you're making a profit, but I wouldn't buy it for anywhere near that. I buy it for 10,000 or under, which I can find pretty often in the trading plaza. So as you can see here, once you buy a whole bunch of shards, you just come here and you craft a huge potion. Because I was lucky enough to find these magic shards for only 9,000 each, I'm basically making a 35% profit on each of these huge potions that I sell. But it's okay if you find them for like 10,000 or even a little bit above that. I want to go too much higher because it is going to take a while to sell all these huge potions. But yeah, that's basically the strategy right there. You can make instantly 35% profit and then you go back to the trading plaza, sell all of your huge potions, and then repeat the process by buying even more magic shards. So you can do this process over and over again, which I've been doing, uh, especially when I go to sleep. Uh, I'll just go ahead and buy a ton of magic shards, craft them all up into huge potions, and then AFK in the trading plaza while I sell all of the potions. It usually doesn't take that long, but because I'm selling so many potions, it's just easier to do it while I'm asleep anyways. You don't have to do it while you're asleep. You could just sit in the trading plaza and do your normal trading and sell while you're there. And if this method wasn't good enough already, there's an additional benefit to doing this. So there's actually two achievements for using the magic machine. So as you can see here, if once you use it for 100 times the first time, you can get two of the magic orb books, which are worth almost a million right now. So that's just free profit. You could sell those along with your huge potions. But then once you do it, 350 times after that you get a free overload charm so this is huge guys you just get a free 5 million profit for absolutely nothing on top of the 30 percent that you were already making so if the prices of the magic shards actually did go up you could still probably make a profit by just doing this and then getting the achievement for the overload charm as you guys can see i'm at 349 on this account so i saved it just for the video we're gonna craft one more get the achievement and get this overload charm. So as you guys can see, we have a free overload charm as well as an XP and a TNT charm. So that is just a free bonus on doing this deal. This method can't really get patched. The only thing I can really see happening is that people will start selling these magic shards for more than they currently are now, but it's not really a nerf as you could still get this achievement as long as the magic shards aren't too expensive or the huge potions don't go down in price. Now I'm going to take you guys to the trading plaza and show you exactly how I find these magic shards for such a price. All right, so we loaded into a lobby. That guy was selling them for about 11K each. 11K is over the wrap value, uh, but honestly, you're still making a profit. You just got to weigh if it's worth it enough for you. As I said before, I buy them for 10K. Oh, the, the wrap value actually is going down. The wrap value just updated as it is as it is around that time. So the wrap value actually went down, so we might be able to find these for even cheaper, but I usually buy them for 10K or less. 
the cheaper you buy them, the more profit you make. So if you want to spend more time going around the trading plaza looking for these shards, then be my guest. These aren't that good of a deal, so we're going to move on and keep looking. All right, so we found a bunch for about 11,000 each. Uh, we're actually not going to buy these because I like to get them for under 10. But just to show you, this is basically what you'll find. But some people will have them at 10. People will have them for like 10 mil, 10.5. You don't need to buy a thousand at a time. You just need to buy at least 16. So you could basically start with as low as like 150K if you wanted. But the more you spend, the more you make with this method. So it's just something to keep in mind. So the reason people sell these shards for so low is that they AFK overnight doing the auto fish method and they get tons of these shards and then they just try to bulk sell them really quick in the trading plaza because they would rather do that than spend the time to make the huge potions and then sell them as well. So if you could find a fisherman who just finished and is selling all of their stuff at once, you can get a really good deal. As you guys can see here, this guy's selling them for 10k each, but there's only two of them, which is really sad. So usually I don't even waste my time buying those, but we're just going to buy them. All right. So as you guys can see, that's how you do it. You buy those for 10k or under, or I mean, even if you want to make less money and do more volume, buying them for 11k each really isn't that bad. I do want to note that this is a side hustle I do because sometimes it does take a while to find the magic shards to buy. And then, as I said before, I sell the huge potions at night. But in the past few days, I have been making a lot of diamonds doing this. A strategy for if you are able to do this in a large volume, I would craft them on multiple accounts so that you can get the achievement on each account and get a free overload charm each time just to boost your profits even that much more. All right, so we came back here one more time because I forgot to mention that it does actually take a decent amount of time if you do have a few thousand of these shards to actually craft all these huge potions. So what you can do is use Tiny Task to automate this process and just make it basically click these three areas as I do. As you can see here, this is how I have mine. So each one millisecond, I click in those three spots and it just basically automates this process so I can watch a movie or something. I like to do this part while I'm editing videos or watching some Netflix on the side monitor. So it can take a while if you do buy like a few thousand shards. So just keep in mind, this might be something you want to do if you are doing this method but that's pretty much it that's the method i just wanted to keep it short and sweet show you how to do it how you guys can make money and it is overall just it's a great method i like to do on the side while i'm already trading and flipping stuff in the trading plaza because of the recent inflation and deflation i've i've been doing a lot of trading buying and selling huges so if I come across some shards while I'm doing that, I will buy them up and then also set up my stand while I'm looking for deals and making trades. It's just an overall great method and I hope people don't ruin it with the shard prices. So if you enjoyed this video, please leave a like, subscribe to the channel, comment down below for the giveaway. Make sure you join our discord. This is where we talk about methods like this so you can find out before anybody else does. Thank you guys so much for watching and peace out.